Hey guys, it's Uncle Jonah here and we're back with another home brew review. And today we're off to the brewing shed and he gave me some beers a long time ago. This one is the pear cider. If you have a look, 7%. <laughs> you know how I like my beers and ciders and all sorts of shit. I like them strong. 7%, pretty good man. <laughs> Um, I had a look on your site, dude, and I couldn't find any info about pear cider. So I'm not sure how we did it. Um, and it hasn't been, uh, hasn't been in the fridge, so hopefully it won't explode. We'll see how we go. Well, got a bit of smoke, got some bubbles, that's good. I've got a shed load of ice, a brewing shed load of ice in my glass. Let's get cracking. One of the reasons why I haven't done this one earlier on um, was because I was waiting for autumn proper before I did a cider review. I did the hop cider because um, yeah the hops kind of go off after time so I wanted to do that one as soon as I could but this one I've really been looking forward to. How are we doing? Oh a little bit of stuff coming through. There we go we'll kill it there. Look at that, crystal clear. Nice amount of carbonation too. We got the ice floating on the top. Looks really good, man. I don't know if you've properly cleared this, but um, hey, we'll see. Mmm, interesting. Definitely pears there, but is there any apples in as well? I suspect this might have some apple juice, maybe an apple and pear juice combination. Because as we know, pear cider um, contains apples and pears. Did you know that? If it's a perry, it only contains pears. But if it's a pear cider, it contains apples and pears. Apples and pears? Apples and pears down the stairs. Right, chin chin, let's get in there. Mmm, very sweet. There's the pears. Mmm, not sure. Maybe this is pure pear juice. I suspect not, but maybe. But there's a lot of sweetness in there. Personally, I like my ciders a bit drier, so I'm not sure how you back sweetened it. Um, but maybe, maybe a touch too much. Mm. Mm. Tell you what though, the sweetness is masking the alcohol taste. I don't know if I could drink loads of those purely because of the, uh, the sweetness. If it was a bit drier, I could knock loads of these back, then stand up and then fall over. <laughs> yeah, I, there's no way I'd know that this was 7%. Hmm, interesting. Well, Brewing Shed, you haven't disappointed me, man. I think this is really good. Pear cider, I might try and do some of this next year. Um, let me know how you did it, dude. I think it's going to be a combination of juices, but that's my personal kind of uh, view on the, on the matter. A lovely drink. I think I'd make mine a bit drier, though. Hmm. Very nice on an autumn evening, maybe watching some fireworks, maybe watching children in those weird Halloween things um, and throwing candy at them out the window. Um, guys, we'll see you in the next homebrew review. Take care. See you soon. You know what? I like a nice looking pear. Oh, <laughs>